a delegation of entrepreneurs from Palestine visited Brazil to participate in a Congress of the Brazilian Association of Travel Agencies. The delegation also visited the Air Brazilian Chamber of Commerce to meet with journalists and businessmen from the sector. It is estimated that in 2014, about 50,000 Brazilians will visit Palestine. Our presence here is really to contact with the Brazilian tour operators to encourage pilgrimages to the Holy Land. Pilgrimage is part of our income and it, the Palestinian people have been depending on tourism for hundreds of years and we want to continue with the Brazilian market, inviting them to be with us. It's a great space for one of the industries most important, one of the rubros most important. It's providing room for one of the most important industries, one of the most important groups of the Palestinian economy. It's finding out the business possibilities. It's opening ourselves to the world and opening Brazil to this Palestine that was intentionally absent for over six decades. O Brasil vem mantendo cada vez mais intensas relações com o mundo árabe. Brazil has been maintaining increasingly more intense commercial, cultural and tourism relationships with the Arab world. And Palestine is very active in the area of tourism because it lies within an area known as the Holy Land. They work very well professionally, receiving tourists from all over the world, and more Brazilians are visiting the region each year. Do mundo inteiro, e e cada vez mais brasileiros estão visitando aquela região. Esse encontro hoje. The meeting being held today at the Air Brazilian Chamber is very important for Brazilian tourism operators, precisely so they can sell the idea of Palestine, the idea of the Arab destination, more and more each time. And I am certain that all the operators in Brazil will be involved in this work of selling Palestine to travelers. Para vender a Palestina. <laughs>